Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to show you a map trick and uh, so she's going to help me uh, perform this trick and be my spectator. Okay, so what we have here is a deck of cards, a complete deck of cards and I'm going to ask you to cut it at a random position. Okay, so anywhere? Yeah, like anywhere, wherever you want. Okay, so now uh, we have this and place it at the bottom. Uh, I'm, next I'm going to deal a few cards and you can ask me to stop wherever you want. Okay, so stop. Okay, so now we have these two uh, piles of cards, and what I'm going to do is riffle shuffle both of these uh, so that the cards finally end up in a completely random order. Okay, so we riffle shuffle these cards, and the cards are in a, probably in a completely random order uh, by now. Now what I'm going to do is without looking at these cards, uh, make some changes to this deck and uh, to end up the cards in a very interesting, uh, probably some interesting uh, order of cards. Okay, so yeah, uh, the cards are completely random and uh, I am just making some changes to this deck of cards without uh, looking at it at all. Okay. So I'm done making the changes and what I'm claiming is uh, that the top two cards are actually one black and one white. So one black and one uh, red. Okay, so it's a pair of uh, black and red. Okay, so uh, that's what we got. So uh, I could change the top two cards into a pair of red and black. But maybe it's just by chance you got mm. these black, uh, black and red. Okay, maybe it's just by chance. Uh, okay, so I have the next two, uh, next pair of cards also as black and red for you. Okay. And the next one as well. Uh -huh. And the next one as well. This is also black and red. Okay. And the next one. So somehow I transformed the entire deck into uh, consecutive pairs of red and black cards. So these are the two cards at the bottom. So we have a pair of red and black. The two cards at the top. Pair of red and black. Pair of red and black. Can I, see could, the whole deck? I can remove a few cards uh, and maybe we can look here. So anywhere you reach there's a pair of black and red. You can remove a few more cards and let's see what we have got. We've got a pair of black and red. So we could transform the entire deck into consecutive pairs of uh, reds and blacks. Uh, so take a moment and think about why uh, this might be happening. And there's a very interesting math principle uh, which is making this happen actually. And uh, try to think of what might be special with the starting deck of cards uh, due to which this is happening. So maybe initially the cards were arranged in some uh, some uh, interesting way or some special way which made this which made this happen. So think about it, and I'll share in the next video uh, how this works and uh, and why this works. So what's the mathematics behind this, and yeah, and how you can perform it as well. 